head over to GOG.com and claim King's Bounty the Legend right now. No, I'm not sponsored by them, I'm just trying to look out for you. Now that I've handed over the most important information, I'll go ahead and read the script that I had prepared to sell you on this. 3DO Modern day players have likely heard of the Heroes of Might and Magic franchise, a 1995 strategy spin-off based around the 1986 Might and Magic RPG series. Before Heroes of Might and Magic, though, there was King's Bounty. While you can definitely play the 1990 version in DOSBox, I believe you'd prefer the 1991 Sega Genesis version. Take note that while the Genesis version definitely has better audio, the exploration phase takes place in real time. A 2008 reimagining of it is available for free for a short time on GOG. Called King's Bounty The Legend, it performed well enough to receive four more titles, Armored Princess, Crossworlds, Warriors of the North, and Dark Side. King's Bounty The Legend has a very strange writing style, so it's best not to take it too seriously. While I was trying to find something for footage for this video, the King commented on my early game equipment where I was using a wagon wheel as a shield. There probably aren't more examples of that, but it's definitely a nice touch. A distinctive part of King's Bounty The Legend is that your wife and kids are treated as equipment. One FAQ I've skimmed suggests you not to get children if you're looking to have the highest stats. And the manual reminds us that should you later decide to separate, she will take one-fifth of your gold and any children. This game is free from Good Old Games until September 4th at 9am central.